The city of Prestonsburg ushered in the beginning of the holiday season on Thursday by lighting up their annual Christmas lights display at Archer Park. Mountaintop News was on the scene with Mayor Les Stapleton as the lights went on for the first time this year. Get out here and see it. It's, it's wet, you can't get outside, you can stay warm in a vehicle, and this is the place to be. The display which will be up for the rest of the month, has already proven to be a hit as a continuous line of spectators cruise through the park during the event to enjoy the scenery from the warmth and comfort of their vehicles. The park is also open to foot traffic as well for those that prefer to walk through and see all of the over one million lots up close. Lots will be up till January, well actually December 31st. That'll be the last night you'll be able to get to see them. That's when we have our star raising event. That's when the star will rise at midnight, boom, fireworks, all the fun stuff. So we try to make it a holiday all the way through to the first of the year. Here at Pikeville Medical Center's Heart and Vascular Institute, we have assembled a comprehensive team of cardiac specialists bringing expertise from all regions of the nation and the world. We have coupled that with cutting edge technology, providing them the best equipment and operating rooms available. The result is comprehensive cardiac care for the people of our region that is second to none. The Heart and Vascular Institute at Pikeville Medical Center. The park was alive with excitement from the very beginning of the evening. Many friends and families chose to attend the lighting of the Christmas display at Archer Park together on its first night. Mayor Stapleton and his wife were both in the parking lot to personally greet guests as they entered through the main gate. In fact, the mayor even excitedly recalled an interaction he was able to have with a group of local teenagers who he recruited on the scene to help get the lights going and the ceremony underway. Well, let me tell you, it was so exciting. We have a lot of kids that come out and help us. We, uh, we had a group of seven kids came down the hill a while ago to watch the lights turn on. They walked from all the way over in town. And I asked them, I said, what are you guys doing? They said, and they thought they was in trouble. Well, nothing, nothing, nothing. I said, help us turn the lights on. They were so excited, and they were teenagers. <laughs> so they went over, they helped us turn some lights on. We got families turning lights on in different areas. It's, it's becoming a, an event every year, the turning on of the lights. And you can look right now, look at the cars already coming down the hill. I mean, it's, it's unbelievable. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joshua Sloan.